Well, there it is, Parliament Hill, though today it's Party Hill, that's because it's Canada Day, Canada's biggest holiday, everybody's got the day off. Well, actually, not quite everybody. We're going to show you how many hardworking people it takes to put on Canada's best party, while the rest of us are putting on our party hats. <laughs> Canadians have been working at Canada Day celebrations since 1958. Their job is to turn the entire Parliament Hill area into one huge theme party for 300,000, including some VIPs. The Prime Minister, there's the Mrs. Prime Minister, and here's mine. He'll switch. There's mine. Most, the job won't finish until well after the fireworks finale late tonight. But the work starts at 6 a.m. <laughs> Therese St. Ange is the party planner. And then these barricades want to be in place until fireworks is not She's responsible for everything from barricades to greeting VIPs. You have good connections. <laughs> Straight to the top. For Therese, it's a 20-hour day. Have a nice day in the nation's capital, guys. What makes me proud is all the people you see on, on the street with their families, kids, people talking to each other, smiling, having really a good time, celebrating themselves. To me, there's no price to that. And I love it. I love it. And that's what makes it special. Hey Brad, what's it like working Canada Day? Here, I'll show you. Let's go faster. Thought about Weight Watchers, Brad. Canada Day in the nation's capital is one huge showcase of Canadian talent. It's Joel Delacuy's job to hire every performer and wrangle them to the right stage at the right time. So now I'm on my way to the Lord Elgin Hotel and uh, we're going to pick up Tara McLean. Hi Tara. Hi, I'm Peter. I'm wrangling you today. Okay. So don't make me use my whip, okay? okay may I carry this for you? Oh, wow, you may, absolutely. Okay, PEI's Tara McLean is a fast rising singer songwriter. She's interrupting her American tour for this important date. It just feels good. As soon as you cross the border, there's this incredible, peaceful feeling that comes over. Tara has one of the more glamorous jobs here, but behind the scenes, a crew of eight toil at an essential service. Today we do about, uh, give or take, about 200. 200? 200, every hour. Wow, so how, how, how long a shift are you going? Oh, there's two of us, two of these pump trucks working today from 7 this morning till about 7 tonight. Wow. Then another shift will work till 2 o'clock in the morning getting all these toilets off the hill. With some 300,000 people expected here today, as you might guess, crowd control is one of the biggest jobs on the hill. Put on a little weight for that belt, if that will do. Yes, sir. The hair, we won't get into the hair. Okay, okay. let's not get into the hair. Okay. Uh, Sergeant Ken McLean is head of Parliament Hill Security, but today there's a little more to it than that. Their duties today are strictly PR. Mm -hmm. You're going to help us with move some of the people, a little bit of crowd control, make sure nobody gets hurt. said we wouldn't be able to walk 10 feet, we haven't moved two feet. <laughs> My mouth is hurt from smiling. You just stop smiling after a while, I guess. For the security part of the job, I'm assigned to yeah. Constable Gina St. Germain. Now those hats would be hot. You have to be, eh? But at least you get the breeze up the kilt, I'm thinking. 
We're standing on guard for the Prime Minister and the Governor General. Their approach is signaled by the arrival of a whole platoon of men in black tight guys, you know, with those thingies in their ear? While I keep a close watch on the crowd, I can't help but notice someone is keeping a close watch on me. As a police officer on guard, what we're supposed to do is watch the crowd, see if there's anything suspicious, and if so, to report it. Mark, were you watching the crowd, you. or uh, were you looking at them arriving? Okay, I was looking at them arriving. Uh... So what are we going outside? Okay, can you guys what is that? Go outside. Well, what a scene. You know, there's been entertainment all day long in stages all around the hill, but now everybody's gathered here for the big show that's broadcast right across the country. It's the final act of a long day for the best party planners in the country. Well, that's it. The show's done. Most of the folks have gone home, but for some people, the work is not over yet. How much garbage do you figure you're going to pick up? Well, I would suspect uh, 25, 30 tons tonight. And the last people working will be Jim Curran and his crew. They're only partway into their 24-hour operation. It's sort of sad to see these little Canadian flags come to such a pathetic end, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, you'll pick up a number of those tonight. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Their job won't be done until the sun rises again on a spotless Parliament Hill. Today's milkmen, do they really deliver? Yeah.